Right, welcome back, guys. Uh, we're now on to part eight. Right, we're just going to raise that up as such. Continue this along to the end. And up here we go. So we're going to take a window right across. Okay, then. Two, three. Okay, here you could put uh, four glass blocks. Two, three. Take that up there. Take that there. Take that there. You could put a glass block there. Two, three. Okay. Let's raise this up again. Raise that up. Uh, actually, second, second thought is bring that across. Second thoughts, we're going to do that. Uh, do that. Take that across as such there. Uh, no, let's put a stair as such. Yeah, that's, that's better. And let's extend that <clears throat> like that. Take this across. Find there. Move over here. You can just put two redstone comparators there. Um, not that it's going to be doing very much. So let's just bring that across there. Uh, take that across there, 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 and there. Okay. That concludes that. Take that across there, there, and then Okay, right, let's just uh, finish all um, our perimeter over here. Okay, raise that up there. But you can put two glass blocks there. Um, let's just finish this off over here.
we'll come back to there. I just want to get the uh, the outer shell up here. We pretty much just actually copying uh, the outer here yeah, of what we had before. Okay, just fill this in again, raise this, should I say. Um, just before we forget, we can just take a ladder up there. While we're down here, let's just raise this as well. Okay, right now, let's just raise all the, this up as well. Can put a block of uh, redst uh, redstone block there. Okay, just make that office one. Right, you can make that control room one. Put a redstone block on the top there. Right, let's just come over here. Um, let's put that as such there. 
up them. I can take that across there. Put that there. Skycar block there. Two glowstone there, so we've got a bit of lighting. there okay do the same there extend this up here put a bit of lighting in there take that across there into this area. Okay, your redstone block there. Okay, control room two. Okay, office two. Right, just raise this up. Redstone block. just go back up here um, what I want you to do is I want you to fill in um, this area with your smooth stone um, but hang on let's before we do that let's just do that let's 
Let's bring your smooth stone down here in line with there. One, two. One, two. Now just get your normal stone. Um, look, we'll come come back to this here now. I just want to put this here because um, I want you to now fill just this inner part in here. Uh, just put a quartz there on the top there. Okay, let's just go back here. Run this one all the way down. Let's just stop there for a sec. Now, of the stone, do the same uh, with the plain stone all the way down. We're just having two rows of plain stone. Just for now, let's just run this down as well. I don't want to go all the way down. Okay, let's just come back down here now. Uh, what we're going to just do here, but get your grey concrete. Um, okay, on the seventh one, yeah, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Just put a grey concrete in there. Um, put it there. Uh, I don't want to confuse. Okay, I tell you what. Let's just let's just fill this in here. Uh, let's put about two rows down. Okay, now, as far as our grey concrete, we're going to bring our grey concrete down to in line with this one here going to bring your grey concrete to that point. Okay, this is also going to be a marker for what's coming up on the uh, the next level. Okay, coming back here. Okay, so have you got that here? That shape there, guys. But now what I want to do here... Um, just get that as such.
Okay. Let's run this back down. Okay, now we're going to partly fill in here. Um, right, I'll put that there. So this here will all be your stone. Just do that quick. Your smooth stone. Okay, coming back here now. Right against this wall, run with your smooth stone back. Put just one there in the corner. Then run your stone down. And you can put two rows here. Get your grey concrete on your six one. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. There's a gap of five. Just put a grey concrete there. Okay, you can now fill this in with your smooth stone. Now bring your norm, your plain stone. Run that back uh, till you hit the grey concrete. And then run your stone there back. Okay, now fill this these two rows in with um, smooth stone. Okay, just have a look there, that's that, 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 that done. Right, let's just go back up here. Right, that's great. Right, what are we now going to do? Right, let's look at tackling the inner part and we'll work from the center back out to the outside here. Okay, right. Right, we're going to raise that. Then on here, right, we're going to go one, two, three, four. One, two, three. 
No, uh, uh, sorry. No, that'll be three there. It'll be three as such there. Uh, three there. Three there. And three there. Okay, then we're going to just over here. Over here we're going to go one end like that. On each of these corners. And one right there. And then you can fill that with the uh, lava. Okay. Just something over here, what I think I may have missed out previously. Okay, in that corner there. You can put a diamond block. Um, then do that staggered out. So it's going out diagonally. Okay, now we're going to go over onto this side. Uh, I want you to close this in with a square of glass, just like that. No lava, nothing. Just get this way, so we're front facing back. Okay, now, what we're going to do, we're going to raise that up. Oopsie. And take that out as such. Okay. Going clockwise, raise that. Raise that. There. Okay, now what we're going to do is directly above all of these legs coming up, um, just put a polished granite. Now what you're going to do, excepting, you're going to leave an opening here. Um, we're going to put a handrail all the way along here. Handrail on rods. Okay, now we're going to do the same over here, but where our stairs are, you're not going to close that in. Leave that open. Leave that open. Leave that open. Okay, we're back here to the front. Now, and all you're going to do now is 
extend that by two. Um, but I'm just looking at there, there's two there. Something is not quite looking right. Let's just go back here. Um, yeah, that's right. I think one of them looked a bit short. No, that's right there. Oh, yeah, that one there. That's right, okay. Knew something did not quite look right. Okay. But what I want to look at before just finishing off there, um, I just want to make 100% sure that we have um, done everything else around the perimeter. Okay, that's all looking good there. That's there. Ah, oh, hang on. There's something here, guys. Um, get your ladder and put two like that um, on either side of there. I know it is a very small detail. Um, and really, if no one knew that it was there, uh, no one, no one would would miss it, and no one's going to criticise you if you don't have it. But okay, right, that's that, and back there, back to here. Okay, right now, let's move down here to this section. Right, let's just have a look over here. Right, we're going to take that across uh, as such. Raise that there. Raise that there. Put that there, put that there. And then we're going to put three glass there. There. Put glass in there. Two, three, two, three. And let's put glass there. Take that up there. And let's take our glass all the way down. Put that there. There and three glass there. There, one there, one there, and take glass across. Take that across there. Take that across there. And fill that in with your glass. Okay, now comes a little bit of the tricky part here. Now we're going to take our, our piston here, uh, face that up. Okay, you're going to put that there. And put that as such. Piston, piston, quartz block, and that. Wow, 
Okay. At least we know that all works. <laughs> And we're putting that on each, and you'll see. Whoopsie. So when those retract, those iron bars are staying out like that, okay? All right. So that's the way it is. I guess that wasn't too tricky and we're not too bad, was it? Okay, now, all right, where are we? I'm getting lost. Okay, we're now coming over here. Raise that. Oh, what I want to do, have those, the top ones pointing down um, as such, okay? And I want you to put one iron bar um, on the top here. Now what we're going to do here, you're going to now put yellow on the top there. Point those down. And once again, iron bars on the top. And over there. Right. Okay, now once again, we're going to raise this another one up. These are like transformers. Okay, that's it for this level. Right, that's it. Okay, now just before we move up, we're just going to finish this off here, um, and we're going to raise this um, another level up. This one we're going to take across as such. Okay, now, what I want you to do, guys, um, just run this all the way around your perimeter, raising this up um, another level. Do that, um, and we can come back, and then double-check, and then we can move up yet another level. Okay, right. Now that we have our uh, boundary fence uh, raised up, um, just a quick thought, just before we go on to the next level. Now, guys, this is... Um, this is entirely sort of optional um, up to you guys um, if you're wanting to, to do this um, thought I'd just actually just do that just to get a bit of light in this uh, area below now um, these offices over here you can uh, furnish this um, I'll leave this entirely up to you of how you would like to furnish it, uh, but I can just give you a few a few pointers. Um, and um, as I say, if you don't want to do it, well, you don't have to. Now, as I say, what you can do, uh, if you like, uh, um, you could just actually take this up here.
Uh, you can either put your bookcases on the side um, like that. Um, remember, you have got the thickness of your walls um, that if you like, you can um, uh, put your bookcases, build, uh, build them in into the wall if you want. These are, are just options um, for you guys to, to consider. I'm just actually throwing um, ideas here of, um, of what you could uh, possibly do. I'm going to leave that like that there. Just something. Okay, just to sort of make it look a little bit, a little bit better. Um, what you can also do over here, you can actually put a uh, what's his name there. Um, you can give that a specific name if you like. You can call it Control Room Alpha or Control Room 1, entirely up to you. Um, now, something else of what you can do here. Um, over here, you can create a, um, a service hatch um, or a maintenance, maintenance uh, shaft. Uh, I'll show you here. You'll see what I mean. Let's just take that through there. Um, you can punch a hole there. Put a redstone um, uh, block there. Put a, a light there. Do that. Uh, can close that. Punch through here. And then you into your area over here. This is why I say you can call this um, a maintenance shaft. And it'll take you all the way through where your controls are uh, for your um, your pistons. Do that. Just keep a bit of uniformity. Do that. And yeah, you can call that. Maintenance shaft one. It's just. Purely an idea, guys. Uh, it's up to you what you would like to do. Uh, oh, yes. Now, on our control room here, what you can also do here, let's just have a look. You can always put a lectern down there. Uh, it could almost depict like a bit of like a control panel of sorts. And you could put a carpet down there. Um, if you like, you can put two chairs for staff overlooking the area. To the right, you can put uh, bookshelves. You can put a chest down if you like. And just in front of our control switch over here. Um, you could put a table. Okay, um, they they are thoughts, guys. They are thoughts, and what you can even do over here, if you like, um, you can put uh, bookshelves there. Going around, and if you like, you can also maybe put um, something like that down. Uh, a brewer stand. As I say, use your imagination. All I'm doing is I'm just giving you guys a couple of um, a couple of pointers. Right. Okay. Um, now going over to other control room. Now what I have done is I have literally just put a carbon copy of that. Um, this point is me wasting time, 
and doing this step by step um, you can actually do do it yourselves likewise this office down here um, guys you know as I've said before just use your imagination I don't need to be um, literally holding your hands likewise here create uh, another um, sort of uh, what you call a maintenance shaft over here so literally what we have done in the first part um, just work away and do exactly the same on the second half there you can change the names uh, change the decor slightly uh, I'll leave that entirely up to you after all it is your build okay right now without further ado let's uh, move up I am fast approaching the one hour my cutoff time for this video uh, so I may just make a start and then we'll um, end it and then uh, go on to our next part where we'll proceed with the uh, next level up. Okay, right. Uh, we've got about 10 minutes left. Right, what we're going to do here, uh, we're going to work on um, our perimeter again. Just want to stop at this point. Now over here in the middle, um, just put two oak fence coming out there. Um, we're going to be putting a light up here. Uh, I'll think about this. Okay, all right. Anyway. Uh, shall we just extend that now across the top? Okay. Over here, let's just have a look here. Uh, right, just in line. Um, with here, put three quartz slabs and three quartz blocks. I'll just bring that back. I'll put a sea lantern. Let's do that for now. I'll come back to that. Let me just finish off here. Change in mind there. Um, let me think about this. Right now, we're going to just run a glowstone across here. Then we're going to put our smooth stone uh, slab here. Now, let's take that to the end. 
So, so that will, in fact, overhang like that. Okay. Okay, we'll come back to the inner part here. Um, no, not smooth stone. Right, we're going to run this down now. Like as before, we're going to just sort out our outer perimeter uh, of our building first, and then we'll work inwards. Now what we're going to do here... Um, we're going to run this all the way back. And then take a glowstone all the way back as well. Bring your smooth stone slab all the way back as well. Okay, now on this side. Oh, I said I was going to be doing the outside perimeter. Um, all right, we'll just finish this passage. as part of our hidden uh, recess lighting. Okay, all right. I'm jumping, I'm jumping around. Right, let's finish up. our smooth stone uh, change my mind there let's do that a smooth stone slab Come back and finish that off as well. Um, okay, let's just go back here now. Come back. I'm jumping, I'm jumping. At times I can't help myself. shouldn't be there. It should be like that. Same. Push that up.
I can raise this up uh, here, here as well. Or just before I forget here, extend your ladder. You're just basically doubling up here. Okay. And just run this through two rows as well of your smooth stone. Now here you're going to put a glass on the top there. Okay. Right, let's just... We'll come, come back here, we'll come back here. Right, back here to the front. Comb there. Okay, so we've just gone around the the, the boundary. Right, uh, we're going to now sort of work on finishing off um, this uh, inner outer section. But anyway, guys, look, we're basically already on an hour hour, or have already surpassed an hour. So I'm going to end off here. Um, and please, guys, don't forget to give it a like share and please subscribe as your support is of great help and motivation to me um the link is is here that'll take you to part nine 
Okay, guys, see you there. Thanks a lot. Bye.